Faye Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a double-headed serpent from the Aztecs. I'm going to take one finger up towards the top over here on the left and I'm going to put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw a straight line down. At the bottom I'm going to draw a curved line down, straight line across. I come back to the dot up on top and I draw a slightly curved line in, one curved line up, one curved line up, curved line down, and leave it floating. I come back to the bottom over here and I'm just going to draw a little straight line down, straight line in, curved line up. Now because it's a double headed serpent we have to do the right side too so I go on the right hand side with one finger and I put a dot from that dot I draw a straight line down a slightly curved line down straight line over and stop come back to the dot we're going to draw a slightly curved line in curved line up curve line up, around, and leave that floating. Come back to the bottom right over here, draw a little straight line down, straight line in, curve line up, and leave that floating. I come back to the left, come all the way up here to the top, I'm going to draw a curve line up, curve line down, connect, come on the right hand side right over here we're going to draw a curve line up, curve line down, connect. Come back to the left hand side on this section right here we just draw a curve line, connect on the left, come on the right hand side draw a curve line, connect on the right. Right about here on the left we're going to draw a circle and then on the top part going down we draw a curved line curve line connect come on the right hand side draw a circle come towards the back draw a curved line out in connect I come back to the left I'm going to draw a big curve line down curve line up connect and on the bottom I'm going to draw a semi curve line up, down, connect. Inside I go zigzag, zigzag, zig, zag, zig. Come up to the front, zigzag, zigzag, jump over, zigzag, zigzag. I come on the right hand side. I draw curve line in, curve line up, connect. A little bit further in, curve line out, in, connect. Come up to the top, zigzag, 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 zigzag. Come to the bottom, zigzag, zigzag, zig. Jump over, zigzag, zigzag. Okay? Now I come back to the left and right above, I'm going to mimic this line. So I draw a slightly curved line out curve line, I mean straight line in, connect on the left, come on the right hand side, we're going to do it again, slightly curve line out, straight line in, connect. Now I come over to about right here on the bottom and I'm going to draw a big curve line, one, two, three, and connect, and I come right up here to the top, and I'm going to draw one, two, three curve lines, whoops, and connect. Okay. Come back to the other side on the left, and we're going to draw a big curve line up, connect.
connect in the center big curve line up connect over here on the right big curve line up connect okay I think that's all let's see how we're gonna color this in okay <clears throat> excuse me everything is whatever I do on the left I'm gonna do on the right so the first thing I'm gonna do is color in my eyeballs and I'm gonna carefully color in the mouth inside so it looks like his mouth is open on the left and on the right okay and then I'm gonna color my teardrops black because this is in reality a sculpture and these are openings so you can see okay then I'm going to double color my nose pink and the outside rim of my lips so I'm just going to put a, a little bit of pink on both the left and the right and then I took my red and orange and I'm going to color over the pink just to give it a little hint of red and over the pink on the mouth so whatever you do on the right you do on the left whatever you do on the left you're gonna do on the right okay then I take a little bit of brown and I kind of outline with a loop-de-loop -loop all the way around the eyeball and color this section in brown and again whatever I do on the left I do on the right same thing here I'm gonna do a little bit of brown on the outline and color this section brown too okay <clears throat> the whole entire serpent is turquoise and that's because in the real one which this is kind of like it but not really it's all mosaic turquoise little tiny pieces of turquoise all the way around the loops the head it's just a beautiful piece all turquoise blue little teeny pieces of turquoise so you can imagine when the conquistadors came in and saw this they were astounded by the workmanship and also just by the beautiful mosaic work that they did the Aztecs did so this should all be turquoise blue okay let's see what it looks like all colored in okay here is my Aztec double-headed serpent all colored in if you google this you can see the real one and it's absolutely gorgeous okay bye bye